Hey there, Scorpios, and welcome back for another general love reading. Shout out to you beautiful Scorpios of the world. The sun is shining on you. I know that this may be for some of you guys kind of challenging because the whole world is going to remind you that it's time for somebody to love you and that if you don't get a big old Valentine's or a big old box of chocolate or a big old teddy bear that somebody don't love you. Well, honey, you can get those things anytime and you can get those things for yourself, okay? But for some of you guys, you may have someone coming in that want to gift you something here. Uh, you may have, like I say, I feel like a lot of you guys are about to reconcile or somebody's coming in from your past here, Scorpios, because they're already missing you and the world is going to have even the hardest of the masculines and even the hardest of the feminines feeling some type of emotional romantic way because love is in the air. It's going to be in the air. It's starting here in February, but it's just going to move on as the uh, days begin to be warmer and longer. And um, I just feel like people are ready to love and express love here, Scorpio. So shout out to you, Scorpios. I hope this video finds you absolutely amazing. Now, this is a general. It's not going to resonate for every beautiful, amazing uh, uh, <laughs> a dime, oh damn, Scorpio and things, uh, standing on business and things, uh, uh, 10 toes down type of Scorpios. Uh, so, you know, use your intuition, only take the part that fits and disregard the rest because uh, it should confirm or clarify what spirit is already showing you. So check it out. You got a chaser here. Now, you know what? I was going to pull you and then whatever their energy is, but I'm just going to pull your overall energy here. Now, it's either you chasing somebody or, or they're chasing after you or about to chase after you here. So, you know, this is a general. It's not going to resonate for everybody. But if it does resonate, Scorpio, please like, share, and subscribe. It says chaser and codependent relationship. Y'all, I'm behind the screens because, like I said, I didn't even go to sleep till like 4. Oh, then I had to get up and then go put my car in the shop. And then I got to get up again in the morning to go put my car in the shop. But it's okay. It's okay. It, I mean, look, you got to do those things. So, you know. Uh, but... I do feel light. I don't feel weighed down or anything. You know, it's just like, it's just like when I, when I, when I leave out and I go places alone, spirit always reminds me that I have that freedom. Um, especially when, you know, because look, I'm look y'all. It's been, I, I can recall days when I didn't have any, you know, I didn't, I didn't have the freedom to do it because I was a single mother and I had to put my children needs and we was barely making it. So, you know, of course I felt, found time to go out, but it's not the same because when your children are older, uh, you still, you're going to always be mama and they're going to always need you, but they don't depend on you because they can, you know, they can look out for themselves. And when you're a mother, you got the weight of the world on your shoulder and you feel burdened down and then not to, not to mention love too. So, you know, it's almost like, like in the other reading spirit was pointing out that little silver lining in your life that although things may not be all the way where you desire them to be, uh, but, but, but still being able to see something good in it in spite of maybe the uh, other experiences that you have, because there's always uh, the good side and the not so good. We're going to say bad. We're going to say not as good. Okay. Or not like the other good side. Okay. Uh, it's all a part of balance here. And then of course you have hand of cards here. It says, take a chance, risk being strategic options, not showing hand gambling. I feel like this is the full energy. Take a leap of faith here. So it could be that somebody may be about to chase you, but now because it says fear of abandonment issues here. So I feel like whoever the person is that has fear of abandonment issues or the person who is running, because check it out, Scorpios. You know, a lot of times you think that they are running from you, but sometimes if you don't check your own energy, you could be pushing them away. You know, sometimes when you're still dealing with, you know, un unresolved issues from, from whatever part of your life, because we all, you know, gather up baggages in our life, we all do it. And if, there, if we don't constantly purge it and release it and detox it, then we're just going to keep on piling layers of layers of layers of other folks stuff and just the life stuff here. So, you know, sometimes, you know, you could be kind of defensive and, 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 you know, out of fear or whatever, and they take it the wrong way and feel like you're really not interested in them. Uh, so, but like I say, you could actually be the one that's running and they chasing after you. 
Can't keep running in and out of my life. It's almost like keep running. Keep on running. Somebody running. Y'all remember the runaway bride? So see, someone here needs to take a leap of faith and change it up a little bit here. Because I feel like the way that things are going, it's really not enough because the next card is not enough. Frustrated in relationship, lack of confidence, self-sabotage, fear, ego issues, jealousy. So it's this, the person here who you may have, let, let's say if you're chasing them, it's because they're insecure. Check it out, Scorpio. If you if if your person finds you running, you running, and they happen to chase after you, then once again, then you're the one that need to work on your inner self here. Um, build your confidence, love on yourself. You know, heal from some things. And so, Spirit is telling somebody, you gonna have to take a leap of faith because somebody is running away from something beautiful because out of fear and not feeling like they can actually get it. Or not feeling like they are enough. And I feel like all of us have been there, been there sometime in our life where we, I don't care how much the world or people around you may, you know, you know, raise you up. You may not be feeling all of that here, but check it out. Your overall energy is the eight of wands, Leo, Sagittarius, and Aries, fast moving energy here, followed by the ace of swords. Clarity, truth here, breakthroughs here. Then you got judgment and I'm going to read them just like they coming out. Judgment. And you got the devil, the devil, doom, 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 doom. Capricorn energy. So you got Leo, Sagittarius, and Aries, Libra, Gemini, and Aquarius, Taurus, Capricorn here. And you look, you got some, this is some powerful energy. So somebody may be, somebody may be about to have a, a breakthrough. Now, whether this is you, Scorpio, or whether this is the person that is coming towards you. Uh, if, if it is not you, then it is the person that is coming towards you here. Ooh, there go the nine of coins here. Look at this nine of coins. Somebody's having a breakthrough of what? About their independence, about being free. So for some of you guys, you may not want to be single. <laughs> Ace of Wands. I see strength in Leo's energy. Could be dealing with the Leo. So someone may not be feeling as secure. For some of you guys, maybe it's you. Maybe you feel like you're not financially good enough. You know, maybe you feel like your mind is on other things because I can understand here. It's hard trying to date someone when you got a whole bunch of burdens, financial burdens, and you're, st you know, you're trying to make it in. They may want to take you out. You may not have a babysitter or you may not have everything that you need for yourself. You know, you may feel like you just don't have it here and they may be successful here. So I can understand if you're surrounded by people here who are seem to be successful and you're trying to find your way here. Ooh, look at this. What is this? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight of swords. Now we ain't going to start this again. The four of pentacles. Nope. And that could be y'all stuck in y'all head and blocking folks here. Y'all could be really, really holding tight, closing, you know, I'm talking about really close tight where it's time for you to make up your mind that it's time for you to live. And I feel like this ace of wands and this ace of swords is about to set you in the right direction. Ooh, now see, either this is y'all or this is them. Look at that emperor. Don't he look fine? Look at, look at them bicep. Girl, them arms can rock you all night long, honey. See? Look, 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 look at them pecs. See that? Ain't he handsome? It, that look like Dr. That look like Dr. Dirt of Love right there. That, that, that's how he favor y'all. Y'all don't know how he look. That's how he look. Look at Dirty Dog flexing all out like that. Look, 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 he can. Now, this the type of energy that can pick you up and carry you over the threshold. See? That emperor ain't going to leave you alone. Now, it could be you guys are the emperor. You could be uh, gaining wisdom. Aries energy, Capricorn energy, Taurus energy, Scorpios. Now, we got um, Chaser and Hand of Cards. Page of Wands, if they're curious about the Scorpio, yeah. 
Look at him. He said, oh, you just so pretty. <laughs> yeah, you look cute, ma'am. <laughs> you just so pretty. <laughs> oh, they say you just so pretty, ma'am. You, you, you look like you look like you smell like home baked cookies. <laughs> Homemade rolls, fresh baked rolls, fresh out the oven. They they pull up in their driveway and they smell you cooking. They be like, I bet that's I bet that's Scorpio house right there. They go to three of cups and there go the faith card. Mm. Somebody probably praying for a chance to be with you, Scorpio. Maybe you've been praying. See, they praying. They like spirit. Please give me a chance with the Scorpio, please. And it could be y'all praying. Somebody's praying. Somebody may be praying to make amends with you because somebody may be dealing with a lot of regret with this five of cups. But I know somebody is definitely watching the other or maybe you're watching each other. Look, look these are some little ugly little boys, ain't they? They just look weird. See, Ugh, no wonder. <laughs> I get it. OK, page of swords, Libra, Gemini and Aquarius. <coughs> so you have the higher for the three of cups and the five of cups. Underneath the bottom here, one more card here. Got some pages all around, but them little pages don't mean nothing because you got that emperor here. So I noticed that this is communication because you got the ace of sword as well as the eight of wands. So yeah, there, there's a lot of communication that's about to happen because somebody may be making up their mind. They may be like, you know what? It's time for me to do something. And that go to one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine of wands. Underneath the bottom is the Eight of Cups. Stairway to heaven. Yeah, somebody walking up the stairs away. They walking away from all them cups because their intuition is telling them so. Mm. Or somebody may not be listening to their intuition or maybe somebody is and they go to King of Swords in the reverse. Damn. Who Scorpio, I feel like I feel like it's time for y'all to face something here. With the judgment card here and the ace of swords and the eight of wands, I feel like some of you guys are about to have some type of real conversation that maybe everybody has avoided. But I feel like it's just something in the air that needs to be cleared. And I just feel like some somebody's going to feel the urgency to clear it. It could be that the person here who was running, which, which was got you chasing here. And then it could be representing that for some of you guys, you're, you're chasing after this person because you're not letting them pursue you because you are afraid that if you don't let them know how you feel, then they may get away. But sometimes you can chase them away here, too. So for some of you guys. It's almost like spirit may be telling you, you know, you know, relax, believe this, believe in you, believe in you, in who you are, uh, understand and know that you are lovable and that if you ever for one second start to believe the lie that maybe they're not into me like that, then hurry up and reject and uh, rebuke that and cast it out because that's a lie. And uh, to be honest, would you really want somebody here who did not find find those qualities in you? No. So shit, you ain't losing nothing. So in other words, spirit may be telling you relax and trust in the universe. You ain't got to chase after them because for, for one, some of them may not even really be chase, be worth it. Look, some of them ain't chase after a bull. OK, <laughs> they are not chase after a bull. OK, it's, they're not even worth you scuffing up your feet, getting your emotions all entangled into their little pissy tail. And then they want to run. You, you know how to make them stop, don't you? Just <coughs> excuse me. The best way you can get a runner to stop running is to stop chasing. That's it. Because when they realize that they are running by themselves, it ain't no fun running if ain't nobody chasing behind you, pursuing you now. Come on now. But you got this emperor here. So this could have been somebody here who actually had you chasing after them. Maybe this is you. You, you know, you're the emperor here and you're try trying to take control over your life and move on with your life here. And start over somewhere else, but you sure got that devil card that old. So let's start off with the emperor and the devil and see, because I don't see feminine energy in here, even though it doesn't matter. We're in tarot, but I do see movement. I see a lot of movement. 
I see a lot of mental restrictions, but it could also be obsession too. So let's start off with the emperor, Aries energy. Spirit, what's up with this emperor for Scorpios? What's going on with Big Papa? Ooh, we, I say, ooh, we, child, yeah, yeah. That emperor say, what you think, little mama? I want the whole cup because I got a manly appetite. <laughs> That's what they saying. That that's that that's what they saying. Somebody say, no, nah, I don't want it just a teaspoon. Give me the whole cup. Ooh, Scorpio. Wow. See? King of Cups. This is somebody here who I feel like is already in love with somebody. Somebody is in love and they want this love. The Emperor, Ace of Cups, King of Cups. Come on now. See, and they want it a bu 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 bowed. That go that devil card again. Please be good underneath that. Ooh, we. I say, ooh, we, child. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, now you got the emperor. The emperor is in love with his empress, Scorpio. That's what it is. See? You got, look, see, see, see. You know what's that? And they go to Eight of Wands. You remember we started it off. With the eight of wands, see, see, this your emperor, the emperor in love with the, his empress, see, because this your third card after you, it's the eight of wands, ooh, followed by the sun card, but look, the emperor, clarifying the emperor, you got the king of cups, now you got the Ace of Cups, then the King of Cups. This is for the Emperor. Clarifying the Emperor, Scorpio. Emperor, Ace of Cups, King of Cups. Now look over here. The Empress, the Devil, the Eight of Wands. See? This person is obsessing over you to this. So that's why that Devil card is... But I don't feel like it's an obsession. I just feel like somebody is really into you. And y'all may have parted ways because of all these games. But I'm telling you, somebody may be realizing once again, and I don't, I don't care how many times it come up, I'm just going to tell you, somebody is really in love with you. They're in love with who you are. And, and we don't even see that Queen of Cups, but that King of Cups show came out. So once again, like I said in one of my previous readings, these masculines are ready for love here. But 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 it took the certain type of one to want to bring it out of them, though. And I feel like you done brought it out of them, Scorpio. You done brought out love. And that's what they want. Somebody wants to make and build this love life with this beautiful empress. And I feel like you are all they think about with that devil car because all they want to do is zoom, 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 and a boom, boom with the eight of wands, followed by the ace of wands, <laughs> okay? <laughs> a wink, wink. <laughs> he sees that somebody said, now, 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 now that would make me very, very happy. <laughs> Could be a Leo, could be a Pisces with this high priestess. And this person may be keeping it to they set, but the whole time they in love with Scorpio. I'm talking about you are all that this person thinks about. And I feel like once again, this is somebody here who, or I feel like this is somebody here who, if, they, if you're the chaser, you chasing after them, I feel like this person is about to let you catch them. And if, if you were running and they're chasing after you, uh, they're going to catch you because you may not let them catch you with your stuff and stuff. But I guarantee you with that emperor and that emperor's and the way they, that's the way they feel about Scorpios. Yeah, yeah. That's the way they feel about you. See? You think you ain't all on this person's mind from an emotional perspective? Scorpio, you got this person. You got them, nine of ones. Like I said, this is somebody here saying, you know what I ordinarily don't do there. You know, I don't really be chasing nobody and stuff because, you know, I ain't got time. But you, you running through my mind anyway. So nine of ones is somebody here who needed you to come into their life because this person here may have been blocking. And this could be you may be trying to act distance and detach from this person. But I feel like this if it's your person, because you remember you got chasing. And like I feel like this person here may have been self-sabotaging. Maybe you have been self-sabotaging it. Maybe you both, because, you know, so all it takes is one person. 
if you got two scared people trying to trying to create love, uh, that every little thing that happened, everybody's going to be jumping and looking for the worst outcome instead of allowing it to unfold naturally. And I feel like one person may have been uh, scared and so it triggered the other person. And so now you got a whole mess here. But here this emperor is wanting to come in and change some things. So why is the nine of wands here for Scorpios, Leo, Sagittarius and Aries? Nine of wands here. Two of Wands, because I feel like somebody was blocking this because they wasn't sure. But I feel like with this Two of Wands here, I feel like somebody knows that maybe that's why you got the Ace of Swords there. Someone here could be looking at you like they know what they want now. They want you. They want love because they are in love. And they want to have a family. Yeah. Because you got mama and daddy. And when I tell you, they're thinking about you. Oh, yeah. So this person here dreams about you, Scorpio. This is somebody here who has been having dreams about you. See? You got them dreaming about you, Scorpio. You are a bad mama, daddy. Shut your mouth. Okay? Now, I don't know. You know, some people say that, uh, 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 uh. Uh, uh, that Scorpio uh, effervescence and things. It's just so amazing that maybe they should bottle that shit up and sell it, huh? Look at that. The, see? See there? This person. See? Look. They go to Emperor again. And they go to Six of Cups. See? 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 See there? You making them want to live again, Scorpio. You making them want to live and love again. Now, what's up with this uh, Eight of Wands here for Scorpios, Leo, Sagittarius, and Aries, fast-moving energy, communication, travel, and amongst other things, uh, you got that Eight of Wands showing up uh, a couple of times. So uh, it is to be expected. Uh, like, I feel like somebody here just wants to be, it's almost like, <laughs> it's almost like, see, they go to Queen of Cups. There you go, God dang it. Ooh, we see Ace of Pentacles. All oh, this is coming from the Eight of Wands. See, somebody say, look here, baby. I don't want to play no games with you no more. I promise. I'm, I'm, I'm done. See, they were taking their time or not bringing you something with the Knight of Pentacles in the reverse. I feel like the delay is about to be over because here it is. The Ace of Pentacles coming in. And you know what's from love because you got the kick. Look, look, look. Don't play with me, Scorpio. This is your Valentine's Day love. And I am not into that holiday. But it just seemed like this is th this is the time that, that, that you're going to be with. Is this a lover's time here? See? Look at this. See? Look at your King of Cups with the Ace of Cups. Now you got the Queen of Cups with the Ace of Pentacles. And the Emperor and the Empress. Scorpio, Scorpio, ooh, I say it must be nice to be a Scorpio. This person said they don't want to play no more games. They say we wasting time playing them goddamn games here. So if they, wherever they was taking their time before, that Ace of Pentacles is going to bring them right on back here, see? Six of Cups, see, they coming in. Somebody coming in for you. Are you ready? Now, why is the nine of pentacles here? Somebody could be about to change your status here. You may not be able to tell folks you single for long. So you may have to let go of the mechanic and the male man. <laughs> oh, you can do better now. Okay, you may have to let go of these, uh, 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 the doctor or the lawyer, okay? <laughs> uh, 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 that's that actor, huh? <laughs> Oh, snap. Why is the Nine of Pentacles here for Scorpio's Taurus, Virgo, and Capricorn energy? Mm-hmm. The wheel. I, didn't I just tell you something that's going to change? I just said it. See? Didn't I tell you some of y'all ain't going to be able to say y'all. See, y'all be like, honey, I'm married. And most folks probably not even going to know it because I can easily see y'all, especially if this is somebody here that you have a history with because you got the Six of Cups. I can easily send some. I can easily see somebody telling you, you know what, you love me and I love you. Fuck it, you know. Let, let's go. On. Let's not tell nobody. He said somebody gonna tell you. Let's not tell nobody. Let's just do it. You gonna be my wife and I'm gonna be your husband, and we gonna live. And ain't nobody gotta know it. Man, I just think that would be so romantic. Oh my god. <laughs> Imagine how much lighter you would be. I guarantee you'll be around here floating, honey. You're going to be floating on cloud 69. <laughs> okay. 
Oh, that's it, baby. Let's not tell nobody, baby. I don't want to waste no more time, baby. I know I love you. You say you love me. You know I'm good with that, baby. Ba baby, we, we finna conquer this m and world, baby. Baby, let's get married and not tell nobody. Ooh, I could do that. And they still live in their house. I <laughs> still live in mine. <laughs> Oh, baby, who house we coming over tonight? Well, you know, baby, I know I already cooked, so you might as well come on over here. You might as well come on over yonder here. <laughs> Nine of Pentacles. Oh, this is this video just got me giddy. See, I can feel it. They go their will of fortune. Somebody's not gonna be single for long here, Scorpio, because like I said, somebody coming in here to sweep you off your feet this time. Knight of Cups, they're coming and they're feeling like they can get you. And I feel like how they know they can get you is because this person has been, they call your name. This person calling your name at nighttime. God dang it. What you think they doing? They go to Lover's Card and they go that King of Swords. For some of y'all, it's a Libra, Gemini, or Aquarius. Uh, but they're in love with you. But maybe they have not been showing it. Maybe they've been running. I don't know. Maybe they've been overthinking things. Uh, but like I say, this person know that they can get you, Scorpios, because you're all that they think about. And whatever they be doing in the privacy of their home, in that magician energy, okay, okay, with your name, ain't got nothing to do with you. That That's personal and that's private, okay? And so, yeah, they're, they're definitely thinking about you, okay? We know that. Look at them. Taking stock here. Somebody realized something didn't happen good. Somebody may be, see, I feel like they just got it bad for you, Scorpio. Whoever this is, Scorpio, your person is dreaming about you. Now, why is the devil here for Scorpio? Ooh, this video won't be too long. Let me hurry up. Capricorn energy. Clarify the devil for Scorpio. Why is the devil here? The fool. They said, I be a fool for you. Don't give me the run around. Yeah. I be a fool for you. Let's begin now. Let's start over. Hey, yeah. <laughs> Don't come for me in my scene because I never said I could sing. But I sing when I feel it. And there go that judgment card again. Somebody say, you know what? I'll be a fool for you. I can't stop thinking about your ass anyway. <laughs> Oh my God, it was one of those blues songs where this guy, I don't know what it is. We say, I don't know if she's a cougar, but he's saying the blues song. Y'all tell me for the blues lovers, if you hear this video, what is the name of the song? And his mama was telling him, boy, that, that, that woman just making a fool out of you. She, what you with that old woman for? You know, he was with an older one. Well, now, now, why in the world, don't you know that everybody laughing at you? That woman just making a fool out of you. And he began to say, mama, <laughs> mama, mama, please, you don't know. Mama, mama, you have no idea what this woman do for you me mama I love you too much to tell you because then you're gonna think I'm being disrespectful and nasty so I'm gonna keep it to myself but just know mama I ain't giving her up I don't care he said a whole world can talk crap about me I ain't letting my cougar go <laughs> oh they say you know what I'll be a fool for you I sure will Somebody's finally making up their mind after they have dodged, after they have ran, after they have tried to avoid it. They, they can't get over it because it keeps calling them, see? <laughs> Ooh, Ace of Wands, baby, you got it twice. So you know that this is a repeated energy, like, like, like it's over and over and over again. So what's up with this page of wands here? I feel like this person feels like a little kid. This person feels, I feel like this person has re, um, Let's say if this person here is, see, <laughs> eight of wands in the sun card. If this person like in their 30s or 40s, let's say uh, uh, early 40s, early 50s, then they're feeling like they in their uh, early, late 20s or early, early 30s, okay? They run around here jumping and stuff like they acrobats and stuff. With this page of wands, the sun card, and the eight of wands, I feel like this person saying, baby, you just don't know. No, no, you, you have no idea. I know you think you know, but if you knew, you probably wouldn't like me no more if you knew what I was thinking about you. You probably would look at me like I was a weirdo, so I, I'm, I'm going to stop. 
I'm telling you, y'all, somebody into you like this, Scorpio. But I feel like this is somebody here who you've already known. But some of y'all going to hold back from this person here. See, because they go to nine of pentacles and the four of pentacles. You got the nine of pentacles right here. Like I say, some of y'all, this person's going to change your status here because y'all going to get this person a hard time. Y'all going to try to get this person a hard time, but some of y'all going to end up make, doing makeup. <laughs> Look, it's all in your reading. Don't come for me. Ace of Wands from a Scorpio. Yeah, yeah. Ace of Wands, Ace of Cups, Ace of Swords. See? You got it all around. You got the lovers, the Ace of Wands twice, okay? And not only that, it's because somebody really, really is in love. And you know it with that king and that queen of cups. All right, Ace of Wands for my Scorpio. A spark of creativity passion ignited here i'm talking about just thinking of some stuff uh, uh no sleep <laughs> three of wands and i said somebody waiting on you baby they've been thinking about you and waiting about this for a long time now so this must be somebody here who you ain't with or you in separation with or you don't walked away from here see like i feel like this person sees you as marriage material now because you got the queen of cups see i, I just feel like you just turn this person on I feel like everything about you, this person feels like you are the one. They see you, Scorpio. For whoever this is for, your person is not looking around you, looking over you, looking under you. Now this person sees you. See, I feel like you walked away from this person. Eight of cups in the reverse. But I feel like this person saying, that don't mean shit because you done left. I'm still here. You got the eight of cups in reverse and the six of cups. So it doesn't matter any type of li any lifetime here. See, y'all may have walked away from this person because you felt like they didn't want to commit. Knight of Wands in the reverse. But they coming back around <laughs> with the ace of wands. They waiting on you. But I feel like this time somebody's going to be better with you. All right, judgment again. Why is the judgment here for Scorpios? Clarify judgment. Resurrection here. Awakening. Uh, truth, finality here, uh, answering the call, uh, finally making up your mind and addressing something that you have been avoiding for a very long time here. And I feel like that either you are doing this or the person who is your soulmate or your master, whoever your person is, they're doing this way. Or it could just be the collective energy between the two of you. All right, spirit wise judgment here for Scorpios. Judgment. The high priestess into intuition here being spiritually guided and you know they are because you got the king of cups and see somebody oh so they're gonna do you right baby see could be an aquarius could be a libra all these major iconas you got the judgment with the star card aquarius with judgment reciprocity balancing the scales so this is them saying okay there there was some that it was imbalanced because of what i did okay and, and somebody wants to heal things between the two of you see they said they're gonna come in here and put their work in god dang it they said if they'll move forward if you if, if, if they can have a green light could be a cancer here all right ace of swords for scorpio scorpio you all here lately you've been having some very very sweet romantic uh love readings it's just like it's just been something real ace of swords they go to higher fence maybe somebody's been going to church here why is the ace of swords here for scorpios with this higher fence three of pentacles so like I said, I feel like somebody's looking for a partnership or somebody may want to work together, work on something together as a team. Why is the Ace of Swords here? Got Libra, Capricorn, Pisces, Pisces, Gemini, Cancer, Scorpio, got everybody. Knight of Pentacles, this is something you have waited on. Knight of Pentacles. See, some of y'all have waited for this relationship. Some of you guys have waited to have this harmony back into your love life here where you're feeling love. It feels good, good, good loving somebody when somebody loves you back. And that's a fact. Yeah. Not talking about the 7 to 30. Not the 60 to 40. 
Talking about the 50 50 loving, yeah. Scorpio, you got that 50 50 love coming in because they dream about you, Scorpio. Please like, share, and subscribe.